Pakistan said that she went too far. And that was actually something that... Too far. That, and that's a good piece of wisdom that you could take right there. Mm -hmm. And he's telling you right now, that you're going to lock yourself to where you're going to be going too far. And already multiple people have told you this. Mm -hmm. And you're trying to ignore it. But deep down, you know the truth. It's time to be wise. Stop trying to be smart. You might think you know better. There's people who have already done what you're trying to do. You've actually already done it. Yeah. you already seen where that takes you. Mm -hmm. It's time to start leading from wisdom. Yeah, your program doesn't stop running here. We, we heard what happens. We heard your debilitation. That doesn't stop. You know, this is the best place to have. The best environment to have. The best thing you have to ever overcome your debilitation. These two, or Mama Law and Mama Aya, are very willing to work. Like, you've seen it, like, when, when, when Chief was gone, they was very, they was, I was tight. Like, I was getting, bonding, like, more. I was like, wow. Like, I was very impressed with how you guys were interacting with each other, how you guys were dealing with each other, how everything was being addressed, everything. And it can continue going like that. It can. And you know that it's not true what you're saying, that you guys don't like each other, because I've seen you guys get closer. Mm-hmm. In, in that situation, and I know that wasn't fake, but I do know that self-esteem and having low self-esteem does affect the way you see other people because you feel like you don't deserve, and that's not true, no, no, you do deserve what they are giving you, and you deserve, and you deserve that relationship because it helps you. And you deserve a family that supports you and pushes you to your higher self, right. and you're saying to yourself that I don't, I don't, I don't want that. Right. Yeah. And... Like I said, the behavior, no one in Carbonation, not one character here displays this behavior at all. And it's not accepted here. And Eliana is accepted here, but the behavior is not accepted here. Mm -hmm. The behavior is not that behavior. We're supposed to be leaders of the black community. Mm -hmm. And we're going to be leaders of the black community. Black community, you can see that in everyone else here. A lot of people are inspired. But at the end of the day, this behavior cannot be here. We have to be mature and above the African American community and how we deal with deal with our behaviors. We need peace, harmony. We need to grow and be willing to overcome the challenges of our generational curses. Our parents, parents, parents' behavior is not accepted here at all. So we came here to transcend our people. We came here to take the African American back to an indigenous state. And that's what we, that's our goal, and we're going to continue to do that. We, li we came here to be indigenous to the land, respect the, the, the laws of nature, and to do that, we need, a, we, need to, we need a young, mature people that the African American community can look up to and be like, and be like, damn, or black people in general, all over the world, can look toward our tribe and be like, wow, they did it like this. But we know our interactions and behaviors with the real nigga moments, with just 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 the behavior Eliana has displayed has not has set us back and made us look like we don't know what the fuck we doing either. When everyone else here does, but what people need to realize is how we responded to Eliana behavior and how we stayed mature through it all. That's what people need to see, and that's this is how we always gonna be, regardless. We're not gonna get on that level with you, we're going to always try to stay, it, 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 it is it's destructive behavior, it's destructive behavior, and all we ever tried to do was love you, all we, that's all we want to do is love you, and put you where you're supposed to be once you over, overcome your own debilitations, and that's what we, our goal is, our goal is to show the world how we should be living, how we, polygamy is natural. That's nature. Men are polygamous. Real men, healthy men. A man who's in his good health, good mind, right mind, is polygamous. We teach it. We stand on it. We live it. Uh, all you women out there with the fantasy that a man can be with just you. He can. A man can be with just you. He can domesticate and discipline himself to hold his breath for goddamn 15 minutes too. Humans or any other species can be trained 
to do to, to be domesticated into whatever you would like us to be domesticated into. But is that God's design? Is that the universe's design? No, it's not. A healthy man is polygamous. Now, men that fat, nasty, low testosterone levels because of the food they eat in, circumstances they in, they under the Catholic Church, my state, what? you know, them, them, them false anti-Christians have been domesticated to think, oh, I could be one woman, now don't get me wrong. You can find a woman of your motherfucking dreams. A home. Your bond with one woman could be very strong. That has nothing to do with your nature to want to be with another woman. A man can be, me and Nana Bond can be strong as fuck. I love this shit. This is my nigga. I done found my best friend. But don't ever, ever think that a man only gonna want to be with you physically. And that bond could be a best friendship that ain't got shit to do with a man's nature. A woman can have a child Three she, is, oh, she has a window To make a baby Because we can say sex is for uh, Procreation A woman can have a child Three days out of a month If the universe Wanted us to be like that We would only produce sperm Three times a month as well A woman ovulates And this is her window One week, three days A woman has one week in that week of a month, she has three days a month she's able to have. This is biologically. We're talking about naturally here. A woman can have a child three days. She can conceive three days out of a month. That yeast in their stomach, they fat and nasty, but that's your husband. And y'all hard creepy motherfucker just do it. These, this is the game niggas run. <laughs> Drop her off at the damn bus station. Like, come on, man. Like, I don't never, I don't never hold nobody hostage against their will, dog. I never hold people hostage against their will, man. You know, like, that's not what I'm doing, but I do know the behavior is holding us back in our goals and ambition and what we're doing here in Carbonation, and it has to stop. And that's just that. It's just over. We went through a lot. We've been through a lot. And for this behavior to just continue to, 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 to push forward is not, no, it's not happening. It just is what it is. Um, well, I'm sorry I fast forward through his uh, little biology lesson there, but looks like we have Eliana, aka Velvet, aka Nana, leaving again. Uh, she just left the other night, so I, I actually don't even have any words. Um, I have no doubt that she will be back if she's not already because I'm a little late to the game. This was three hours ago. It's Saturday. I got stuff to do, so I'm not checking for carbonation every second. But I get online, and lo and behold, this is what I see. So we'll finish watching the rest of it, but I have no doubt that she's back. I'm not positive, but I'm just, based on past behavior, she's probably already back. She will be the downfall of him. I don't care about that. I don't think the only reason why they do that because the drama that comes along with this. I don't think people would really, really fuck with us like that if it wasn't for this drama. Like, you know what I mean? Like, this drama, low entities feed off this vibration right here. And then once we let this go, it's going to be peace. Not saying we ain't going to have issues, but we have solutions. We have the problems and we have people willing to deal with the problems and the solutions that we that we push forward here in this carbonation. I feel like everybody here on point. I feel like I should do what he need to be. He, did, he need to do. Have circumstances come to be. I, I feel like Solar do what he need to do. I feel like trying to do what he need to do. True would do what he need to do. You know what I'm saying? Lawyer would do what he need to do. I think everybody here on board. I think we here. If we have a problem, I feel like we'll deal with it maturely. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm just saying that the behavior here has to match. If it doesn't match, then we have to go our separate ways. You see what I'm saying? So we just trying to like show. The, we trying to be an example to the black community of living indigenous and being positive about that shit, man. I ain't no negativity toward nobody. You feel me? Like, we don't want no problem. We just trying to show the world how to live in harmony with nature coming from where we came from. Niggas is from a fucked up place, yo. And what we, what we doing is pushing our culture.
approach us to a further place, and it's an option for us. It's just another option. Or if you want to go be a Hebrew Israelite, you can go go into the test another Hebrew Israelites and see what they stand for. You want to go be a, a more, you can go be a more. You want to go join combination and be in nature, you can do that. So this is just another facet in the age of information for our people to push forward to when this relationship has been toxic. Mm-hmm. For what we try to do, we try to push the culture. Hip hop and everything. We're trying to bring it back to an indigenous right. state. That's right. We're trying to teach truth and open ourselves for challenge and everything. Like, you know what I'm saying? And, and keep building that. And this relationship has held it back. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So it's just time to move forward. You know what I'm saying? That's right. Time to move forward. That's it. I'm trying to. We trying to get land. We trying to establish ourselves so that we can open ourselves to people to come visit us and, and open ourselves to retreats and people come and learn our ways. We, you know what I'm saying? We can't do that as long as we dealing with energies that are take us to a lower state. You know what I'm saying? Every time, like all of our problems have been through this behavior. You know what I'm saying? And it's like it's at this point. It's like. I'm not trying to fail at what I originally stated out to do, period. Mm-hmm. Holding on to anything toxic that doesn't want to stop doing that. I'm willing to, we, we've extended ourselves to help, support, cut our hair. Yeah. We're here, bro. We're here for Eliana. Like, we're here for her. Like, we want to show the world that we don't just give up on people. We got solutions to your problems as long as you're willing to work. But we can't work on them for you. That's true. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We can't, we can't do that for you. We, we can only be in support. And to be able to support you to get back on your feet and do your very best. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Outside of that, we only want a kind of environment that's hostile. Mm-hmm. That someone to be snapping in and going crazy. And mm-hmm. There is nobody here that would have. Nobody here will do that. I have, we don't have nobody here in Carbonation that will snap out and do that crazy stuff other than... You know what I'm saying? Like everybody else, cool, calm, and collected. We're going to talk. We're going to communicate through the problems and issues. Mm-hmm. That's bad. So, it is what it is. Mm-hmm. That's real. And I feel like we had a weak link and we supported her. Like, we supported her even though we could have just got rid of her. Like, oh, like, bye. Nah, we was like, nah, we love you. Like, we, as long as you want to work on your issues, we're willing to work with you. Mm-hmm. We're willing to work with you. We wanted, we wanted the, we wanted the black community to see that we're not just throwing people away. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like as long as you're willing to work on your issues, the door. then we got your back. Mm-hmm. We gonna rock with you because you family. Mm-hmm. And every family got a black sheep. Every family got. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It don't matter. So what? But we wanted her to show the show the world that she can grow. She can change. She can become more. You know what I'm saying? She can change. And there's a lot of people rooting for her right now. There's a lot of people out there like, Nana, you can do it. Come on, girl. Like, there's a lot of people that's like, fuck her. Get rid of her. And there's a lot of people that's like, yo, she can do it. Yeah. Put your mind to it. Okay. You know what I'm saying? awfully slow packing for someone who wants to leave when i want to get up and go i am packing my stuff and i am gone the truth is she really don't want to go nowhere she just wants to keep flipping out she doesn't want polygamy she wants cheap to herself you know this is just a game they play if she really wanted to be gone she'd be gone she's packing way too slow yeah, I'm not stressed. Some people, somebody said, Chief, I hate to see you stressed. I'm not stressed. I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. It's a difference. Stress is one thing. I'm exhausted. I'm past, like, stress. Like, I'm, like, I've exhausted all, 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 all options, all, you know what I'm saying? I, I gave all I could. And so I could, I could let go because I, I, I gave all I could. What, what else could I get? That's going to be good enough. Yeah, 
then she taking the baby, the baby got to go with the mother, right? Like, I don't want that drama, man. Like, I don't want the drama. I don't want, I don't want any drama in my life, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm really, I'm really here trying to, like, make solutions to any problems that I might have. Anybody that got problems with carbonation, we want the solutions. If we can't have solutions, then we want to go our separate way. You go your way, we go. We don't want no issues. We're about to formulate something official. We don't want no issues. You feel what I'm saying? And that's just, uh, you know what I'm saying? And when people don't know I'm a businessman, and this this is a business. This is a business. Carbonation is a business. We're in the business of change. We're in the business of growth. We're in the business of evolution. You feel me? For our people. We, we are our people, and what we do, we doing it for our people. So at the end of the day, I'm going to continue to teach. I'm going to continue to move forward. I'm going to continue to do what I have to do. And I refuse to not continue to do what I set out to do because of a circumstance that was here after I've been doing what I was doing anyway. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, so... <laughs> the ether connection. <laughs> Wireless. Uh, Why does everybody have to huddle around her in these moments? Quit giving her the attention. Let her pack. Let her go. Get away from her. Well, you would never let your baby go that easy and me and you got two different journeys. You know what I'm saying? Me and you are two different frequencies of the same thing. And um, what do you want me to do? Try to take the baby and so she can go screaming and go crazy? No, I'm not doing that again. Y'all seen I got punched in the face. I'm not. I tried that already. Last time I tried that, it, it, didn't, it didn't go well. So this time I'm not even resisting. Like, uh, like, nah, like, what do you want me to do? Like, I'm in the middle of nowhere. I'm just going to get her to where she want to be. And then I'm, you know what I'm saying? And that's all I can do. She's a grown woman. I'm a grown man. We made sure we met each other on a journey. And this, and she wants to go her separate way. I want to go my separate way. She's going her separate way. We have a child together. If she needs support for the child, contact me. Like, I'm here. Like, I'm always here. You know what I'm saying? So it is what it is. Like, I don't know what you want me to do. You can hear it all you want, Lola. You gonna, you don't have to hear it. You can turn it off. You know what I'm saying? You can turn it off. Like, if you're not my friend and going to support me um, and what I'm doing, if you're not my friend and you're not supporting me for what I'm doing, if you're not watching to support, then you're watching to hate. You feel what I'm saying? If you're watching to hate, then you shouldn't be watching anything that you hate. That just reflects who you are to yourself. You feel what I'm saying? Like, if you're here to support me and be my friend and through my ups and downs, through my stupidity, my mistakes, whatever, I'm your friend. I'm with you, nigga. I think you made a wrong decision. So what? I'm still fucking with you. I still support you. If you're not one of those people, then you're a hater. And if you're a hater, then you're watching something that you hate. We give you no energy. You get nothing from us. I don't care how many times you heard me say it. If you're my friend, you ride with me. Ride with me. If you're going to ride with me, you're going to watch. Ride. Fuck with it. Why watch some shit you ain't riding with? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm going to watch some shit, entertain some shit that I'm riding with. Mm. You see what I'm saying? I ain't going to watch some shit I ain't fucking with. You know what I'm saying? So if you fuck with me, just show love. Throw the hearts up and show love. Like, yo, I love you. No matter what you do, I fuck with you. I support you. It don't matter, nigga. I'm your friend. And that's a real friend. A real friend going to ride with you regardless. Whatever you, whatever, it don't matter what you're going through, nigga. No, you made a stupid decision, nigga. I don't agree with what you're talking about, but I'm still fucking with you because I'm your friend. You know what I'm saying? And if you're not, then why are you on my page? Mm -hmm. You're watching for entertainment. So you're entertaining, you're entertaining something that you don't fuck with. Use a lane. And that just, that, just, that just exposes you to yourself. If you don't fuck with me and you're watching me, you're a lane. Here he goes. <laughs> Taking out his anger on the people watching him rather than Eliana. He does this all the time. You shouldn't be looking at nothing that you ain't watched because you got 16 hours a day to, to manifest your dreams and ambitions. And if you're giving something that you don't love and your energy, then you's a fuck nigga. You're wasting your energy. You're a waste of life. You're a waste of life. You're wasting your own life because you're a waste of life. You got time to look at something that you don't fuck with. Even if you're giggling at some shit that you don't fuck with, you ain't got no time to be focusing on some shit that don't got nothing to do with your growth, your mental growth. But if you fuck with me and you benefit from me, then fuck with me. Throw the hearts up. I love myself. Fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? Through my mistakes and everything, no matter what, through my flaws or whatever, love me, nigga. Love me. If you don't love me, love yourself. Fuck is you talking about? And stop watching me and put me on blank, nigga. Fuck is you watching me? You gonna wait?
waste your time because you're a nobody. You're a nobody. You're a nobody watching some shit that you don't love. 16 hours in a day I got. And I'm going to waste it on some shit I don't like. That's the shit I don't like. <laughs> Fuck I look like, man. Throw the hearts up, man. Show me love, man. Love me. Fuck is you talking about? If you don't love me, fuck out of here. Love me, nigga. <laughs> love me. Put, put hearts up. Love me. You know what I mean? Kisses. I want hearts. I want love. If you fu- if you watching this shit, send love, nigga. Then send support, nigga. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. If I'm gonna watch some shit, I'm like, yo, yeah. Somebody put Khadijah for chiefess. <laughs> Y'all stupid. <laughs> shit. <laughs> Khadijah for cheap does I doubt it. <laughs> I fucking love you, nigga, because I'm watching you. I'm investing my energy in you, nigga. Yeah. I fucked with you. I would not invest my energy in you if I didn't fuck with you. No. I got this my energy, nigga. Like, it's my shit. I'm going to invest my shit in shit that's for me. Hey, I, I benefit in watching you in some kind of way. So here's some love. But if I don't benefit from watching you and then I'm still watching you, then I'm, I hate myself. Why would I put myself through that? Fucking, that shit is stupid. It doesn't make no sense. <laughs> I love you all. Yeah, love everybody in the room. Let's love each other. This should be a loving circumstances. Five hundred and sixty-four people loving they loving each other. You love if you love somebody in the room. Tell them you love them right now. You know what I'm saying? Say, yo, I love you. Fuck it. Let me just let you know I love you. You. Say somebody's name in the room and tell them you love them. I love you, Master Star, Master Gia. Tell some random person in the room I love you. Fuck it. Because it should be a love fest in here. Everybody in here should be in love with each other. You know what I'm saying? I love you. And y'all should be networking, too. You know what I mean? Of course we love Eliana. Of course. Forever. Love don't turn off because me, cause me and you got our differences. Mm-hmm. Love is forever. Love is true. Love is boundless. Limitless. You feel me? I love myself. That's right. That's all. That's all we on. None of that negative shit. I got a lot of time to think when I was locked up and I reset to my old self. Like, yo, why am I angry for? Why do I even entertain these people? Like, why was I so angry? I guess I was angry because I was defending some energy that was toxic. You know what I'm saying? It was like, I'm letting it go. I'm letting it go. It's a new day. It's a new day. We're about to have peace and harmony. At least and tranquility. If we can't do that, then how can we help our people? We can't. We have to first establish that ourselves first love and peace and harmony. And then we can extend that to someone else. And we have that, right? We got all the ingredients to have a love and peaceful environment. But we are people that attract hurt people because we're healers because we have knowledge of self anytime you got knowledge of self you're going to attract people that's hurt and there's nothing wrong with attracting hurt people as long as they want to be helped you can't help somebody that don't want to be helped mm, it's real. you know what i'm saying there's a lot of people act like they want to help until they i love how he takes this moment to turn it into a sunday morning sermon like i don't know how he does it but then again, what he's probably trying to do is subliminally speak to Eliana because he doesn't want her to leave. So he's pretending like he's speaking to everyone else with his sermon. Like, get on with it. Just talk to Eliana and tell her you don't want her to leave because the truth is you don't. And the truth is she ain't going nowhere. Get to the point where you have to change. Yeah. And change ain't no easy motherfucker. Yeah. Change is about, you know, growth. And growth is about ca- challenging yourself. Being uncomfortable. Right. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. if you're not willing to deal with uncomfort, how can you grow? Exactly. You, the universe is going to put you in uncomfortable circumstances where you have to, have to get out of those circumstances. I said this yesterday, I think, in one of my commentary, that she will have another episode when uh, Raya, Ra, <laughs> Aya and Ra showed up, there will be another episode. I didn't know it would be last night or today, but I knew it would happen. So, has predicted. And be mature enough to apply certain knowledge, and we are the people that give you the knowledge.
knowledge to apply through those circumstances. You know what I'm saying? So that's our job. You feel what I'm saying? And that's what that's it's on my mind. When I got locked up, I was like, damn, I'm glad I got locked up. It's re reset. It made me think, see think I was away from y'all. And I was I went back to when I originally started by myself. I was laying there and I just felt like I was in in my head, I was in that room in Atlanta. In my head, I, I literally that's the that's the place I was at. I was in that room. When I was locked up, I immediately went to the room in Atlanta that I used to be in. You know what I'm saying? I was there because that was the, that was the last time I was by myself. I think. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it just took me back to that place, being in that cell. It took me back to that place in Atlanta, and I was literally laying there like I used to lay in Atlanta and start. And I went back there. I was like, wow! And it just made me put everything in perspective, of what I was doing and why I'm doing it. You know what I'm saying? And so getting out. I was like, okay, getting back to that. You know what I'm saying? Getting back to that. Yeah. Yo, stop, stop making it seem like anybody being held hostage here. Like, ooh, that's not our move. That's not. That's never my move. Can't hold nobody hostage, Jack. Never. All we do as a family when somebody feel discouraged and they feeling down is we give them courage. We give them, we sit and have a meeting. We talk to them. We try to make sure that they're making the right decision. Help them out a little bit. And we can't hold nobody. Who can we hold? We didn't bring you. We didn't. We didn't. We didn't tell you to come here. I can't hold you here because I ain't make. I ain't. I'm, that's not my thing. Sorry, my husband's starting up the Harley. But also, I seen in the comments somebody saying Khadijah, stop being fake. That's why I was scrolling up. I, I keep missing her comments. I'm trying to get people to not come here. <laughs> Y'all got me twisted. You know what I'm saying? So just know that no one is being held hostage in this place. Like, everybody's here because they want to be here. Like, never, ever start that. Because the thing about propaganda is if you repeat it over and over, and this is what my haters are familiar with. This is what they're famous for. They repeat propaganda and lies over. Or the devil will repeat a lie so many times that you think it's true. And that's what happened. You know what I'm saying? And... How can it be a hostage situation with more people than that? say he was trying to save the black community boy watch your words you you're slipping help. everybody want to help help yourself sure. help yourself sure. you know what i'm saying like and um just 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 let it go let it go you heard let it go it's right, it's right. She got to stop running from herself, but she don't realize she's running from herself. But like I said, man. Can I give you a phone to make a phone call? Yeah, the other phone. You talking, you talking about the other phone call? The other, where, um, how do you use your phone, Sheba? Who's Sheba phone? It's on the couch. Um, it's, it's on the couch. Right there. It's right there. You heard? Know? It's right there. Do that. You gotta have the attitude. Hold this real quick. Why the? Why do the guys got to stand there so awkwardly with their hands? You know what? What are they doing with that? It's so weird. Alright, baby. 
check them out the store in, but Yeah, we need to go through that store. Alright. That's like in the city, right? I would imagine the closest one would be Panama City because it's the biggest city. Well, check out to see which one the closest one. Because it's like three of them. So they're in Panama. Well, that's what Khadija alluded to, I think. Maybe Elysio is tired. It, it, no, I can't believe I just said that. I will be eating those words. I doubt it. She will be back. You would think, though, at this point, they would both be tired of the toxicity, but eh, they thrive off of it. <laughs>
that's the tough thing to say. Wait, did he take her phone back or a phone back and is he not going? Because, you know, the last time, well, there's been many times, the infamous uh, van ride, he always goes to talk her out of it. So, I'll be shocked if he doesn't get in that van.
I'm going to have to go back and read Khadijah's comments because I keep missing them. But people are giving her a hard time in these comments. So I will go back and look. <laughs> going to let her go and she ain't going nowhere look at him crawling in the van he's probably like you sure you sure this is what you want to do and she's like yeah da, 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 that's fact yeah da, 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 da. so whatever she's probably there right now <laughs> you better go on bishop before she hits you with another right hook Better get on out of the, her face. Oh, he can't stop. Look at him. Look. Look. Crawling in that darn van. Look at him. He is not going to let her go. I don't care. On this episode of Love and Flip Flops, will Eliana leave? Will Nature Boy take her back? She'll be cooking him breakfast in the morning. Why is all this got to go down on the day that my shows come on? I got 90 Day Fiance to watch, The Real Black China, Smothered, and now I got to keep an eye on these people on Love and Flip Flops. Can you believe this? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I won't be checking that hard. Hmm, well, maybe. <laughs> Yeah. 
got rid of something that was holding us back in a lot of ways, and that's a good thing. So, it is what it is. It is what it is. This is a good one right here. Right? Okay. Here's the thing about her coming back. If she comes back, she has to abide by the rules here and the frequency here. And if she's not, then she has to go. And that's just that. If she decides in her mind that she wants to work things out, then... Thank you, Kamisha. Appreciate you. Right, Jasmine. When the universe is persistent about removing someone from your life, trust it. Right. I'm not, I'm not, you know, I'm not in resistance to it no more. Well, we're grown. We don't have to record anything about anybody being dropped off. But I will make them record it. I'll call them. Call them. Well, send them a message because they ain't going to be able to get the message until they down the hill. They left already, right? Yeah. Okay. So, thanks. What's up, God Fumes? about her coming back is that for you to be here you gotta be on frequency you gotta be with what we on so if she come back then she gonna have to be on that frequency and we can't keep going back and forth and back and forth either you gonna be here or you not you know what I'm saying and so she comes back I had an epiphany and then she leaves again you about to cook man? yeah we about to make sure we Oh, okay. What's meant to be will be, that's a fact. She said no man controls her. Well, the system is a man. And the system will control you. So, you're going to be controlled. Well, I gave y'all my word. I told you that. It's just at this time, she had, we had, was in a position where I inevitably knew it was going to be over. We was just in a position where I couldn't do it at the time. And she was she had apologized again, and I gave her that opportunity to come back. But I knew that it was over officially after I got punched in the face. Um, I knew that it would take a lot for her to get back where she needed to be and I knew that eventually she, she I know her behavior I knew her pattern so I gave you my word so when I give you my word I, I'm, I, I stand on that but so whenever I knew it was over after that as soon as she punched me in my face bit me on my back I was like oh no you know that's one thing I do agree with him on once it gets to uh, especially with men you emasculate them like that, punching them in their face, throwing their clothes out in the road, whatever it is, usually they're done. I don't really think he is, but I think he, I think he might be getting to that point where he, he ain't going to have a choice to be, but to be done. But I mean, you know, I hate to say that too, because I, we've seen this so many times, but if he did let her go, for real, I mean, I couldn't blame the man for letting her go. I mean, it just went too far. When it gets physical, it's just, there's no coming back from that. Uh, it's over, you know. Um... I don't know if she'll go live. I don't know. I don't know if she. I don't, think, I don't know if she'll do that. I don't think she'll do that. What was it? If she does, inevitably she's looking for attention. 
but I don't think she she will go like I don't think there's nothing to go live about. Like everybody know what's going on. There's no, what can you say other than be two faced? You know what I'm saying? You can say something bad about me, but you was here. You was here. You was with us, and everybody knows the other things you said. So I don't see there being a um a video being done or anything. I think that is more of an embarrassment, if anything. But it is what it is. Either way, we'll, we'll continue to do what we're doing. I am opening. I now. I mean, I just feel like. I'm opening up a space for, 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 for the inevitable to come in. You know what I'm saying? And we're supposed to be here to come here. I think that sometimes when you're dealing with certain energies, sometimes when you're dealing with certain energies, you can't receive what's for you. And I think I'm overdue for, you know some really good women to come along now, you know what I'm saying, so, yeah, there's that, we're done, right now, I'm about to, I'm about to get in the showers and just really, I'm gonna go live, we'll probably talk later, y'all, I'm gonna get in the shower, relax, but I appreciate all the love and support and all the advice, Nana's gone, I know you said she gonna come back, but if she come back here, that means she decided to uh, grow, you know, but I don't think that's the case right now. So like I said, y'all be good, man, I'm gonna be getting up in the showers, and I 